This video will demonstrate how to create a parent account in Schoology. Go to Schoology.com and click on the Sign Up button. On this screen, choose Parent. Type in the parent access code for this first child and click Continue. You will have received this code, perhaps in an email from the school, or from your student's teacher, or at a school event. Complete the information on the next screen and click Register. Note that a parent account can be created for each parent and, if needed, for another adult who might be assisting with the child's schooling. Each adult must use a different email to create their Schoology accounts, and each adult must use the um, parent access code that was provided by the school for the student. Once you are logged in, in the upper right corner, you will very likely see the name of one of your students, one of your children. Click on the arrow, this arrow here, to view your name, it should be listed here, and you can toggle back and forth between the parent account and the student accounts. If you have more than one child enrolled, click on Add Child, and in the little pop-up window here, type in the access code for the next student. Continue until you have connected all of the students that are enrolled in the school. Your children will all be grouped here. If I click on that, then one student shows here. If I click on this arrow, I can toggle back and forth between the students. I can also click on all children. If I do that, then I can view the content for all my children at once. So depending on the preference, you might want to view content for all your children at one time or any uh, individual student. And to switch back to the parent account, click on this arrow here to switch back to the parent. Some things to keep in mind. Some Schoology content is primarily for parents. To view this content, make sure your name is displayed in the upper right corner here. When the name of one of your children is displayed, you can view content, um, upcoming events like those listed here, assignments and other content for that child. Right now there are no posts because this student is not enrolled uh, in courses yet since the fall courses have not yet started. And remember, if you choose all children, the content for all the children will be displayed here at the same time. 